Hello everybody and welcome back to Unicorn Overlord. No, we don't have any sardines. Looks like we have at least maybe like two. Two more areas in between here and there. I said we got enough to upgrade him, so we're gonna use it. Because we use a lane all the time. I must never yield. Cool. just regular liberation quest the day will be ours order must be preserved your orders very well <laughs> to me Militia fights on. Come then. I'm here too. Come then. Your villainy ends here. who can't protect themselves. The time is at hand. The path is set. Alright, show me what you can Come do back. with your newfound power. here. The time is at hand. Come then. There we go. Victory grows ever closer. Liberating things left and right.
Oh, well, I guess I didn't kill you, huh? Allow me, my prince. Here, sure, survey the entire region if you must. You claim the Lord himself to be responsible. Just repeating what I heard, sir, but I do know they've been hauling off the sick. Scary stuff, I'll tell you that. Ah, eh, 14. We can do 14. Easy. Tell you what, let's do this real quick, though. Does that mean... My test complete, these wings now soar for the liberation alone. Be sure to use them well. Yes! Feather sword. Can buff themselves and bear good balance of attack and defense. Oh, can I not level up a feather sword? Thirty, twenty-five, thirty, 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 thirty seems to be the average. Okay. I'll wait until I get 30 and then I can level up. Well, is there like a... Is there delivery I can do? Just to get a couple. Yeah, there we go. I want to upgrade my main party. Best I can. I've much room to improve. There we go. Next, after that. Is that you, sir? What are you doing back in Barbetimio? <laughs> well, I see what's happening here. All your drinking finally got you thrown out of that army. Like hell it did. Say that again, I dare you. How fares that errand you mentioned, Morden? Oh, mm -hmm. uh... Hold on a second. Aren't you the commander of the Liberation? Should have guessed it had something to do with that girl you were so fond of, sir. I knew she'd ask you to fix up the walls, but you had left for the war before you even got the chance to do it. 
Makes sense you'd want to come home and write that wrong, though. You really have to spell it out like that? In any event, we're only here because Morden requested we take a detour as we were passing through the region. Well then, what are we waiting for? The Iron Helms would be glad to help spruce the city up a bit. The ones of us that were left, at least. We'll also need to resupply the Liberation stores. Morden, meaning we'll be staying in the area for at least the time being. If you wish to aid in the renovations, now is perhaps your best chance. Thanks for this, Elaine. I'll try to make it quick. Our old boss hasn't changed a bit, you know. Everyone's as warm and considerate as always. Right you are. And while he often strives not to show such traits, you can sense them beneath the surface almost consistently. At heart, he is one of the kindest, most dedicated souls I've ever had the honor of coming across. Probably one of the heaviest drinkers, too. That's enough standing around, though. I should get in there and help him. All done. Sorry, kid. Didn't mean to drag you into this. Hmm? What are you looking at me like that for? Tis nothing to worry about. Thank you, Morton, for everything you do for us. Uh... That's nice. We still got plenty to do in Draken Hold. That's Alfheim. Let's go here and go up and see what let's see what happens when we meet our way. Oh. Might I request an audience for a moment, your highness? But of course. What is it, Miriam? Well, I was merely wondering how you regard my work compared to that of the rest of the army. There's a surprising level of incertitude coming from you. Yet you needn't assess yourself by the feats of others. Everyone has their own natural strengths, and you are no different. Is there a reason you seek such an answer? Forgive my folly, your highness. I know well that our army's only aim in this war is to vanquish Sonoria and restore the kingdom to its prosper ru proper rulers. Tis the same conclusion I seek myself as well. But I received a letter from my father this morning stating the importance of distinguishing my deeds from those of my peers. I suppose he's purely fixated on what plot our house shall receive upon the end of this war. Recognition from the crown would prove a boon to any noble family, yes. It is a strange contradiction, is it not? Under normal circumstances, a knight is meant to protect their people. Yet in times of strife, we are judged almost wholly on how many enemies we are able to slaughter. It is as though I've, it is a thought I very much despise in Suf. But it's also a necessary one, should we ever wish to bring peace to these afflicted lands. You needn't dwell on such upsetting notions, Miriam. What matters now is that you worked. the work you do is of great benefit both to the Liberation and to myself. And to my eye, you've already achieved the very distinction your father wishes for. I thank you for your generous words, Your Highness. Pretty normal, pretty base. Dig, 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 dig. If the rebels march upon our Zenorian ruins, they must be after the treasures hidden within. Brace yourselves, men. We hold this fortress through any attack. The battle for Istan, and yeah, okay. That's a level 11. I'm gonna roll over these dudes like I ain't nobody's business. Dun 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 The day will be ours. From Lady Melisandre. I forgot I had him be the leader. The 
Cornian militia fights on. I'm ready. Right. The path is set. My blade is at the ready. It shall Your be done. Your weapons are trained on us. In the name of House Mayer. Feet will soon be upon us. They're too slow. I fear for our safety. Hmm. Try me. Do you need something? Heading there now. Prepare yourself. Let's see what they got. I never miss my target. That's one cleric down. They're going to get to me. Your villainy ends here. I'll pierce you clean through. Try me. They're beaten. I'm ready. Right. My blade is at the ready. Prepare yourself. Come then. I've little appetite for mercy. And done. Oh, I fought done. I'll support you. There we go. Absolutely save my process. Progress, not process. Close enough. That was just the beginning. I can tell that. Thirty again. Like level 10, 9, I don't want to upgrade someone that is lower level like that. Who is in my actual party again? She's level 11. Hmm. 
Is there anyone else I'd rather have? Well, Bangaria for one, but I don't have her right now. to my former strength. Daggum, what is it? Just a... Just a huge amount of uh, liberation quest. It doesn't look like we're gonna have any more characters. That should be easy to punch a hole through. The Cornian militia fights on. The day will be out. any distance I'm prepared for anything my steed is swifter than something? the wind heading there now the time is at hand to me they have the advantage come then I've grown stronger How can I assist? I ride at once. You face me. One thrust of the lance is all I need. You can do it. Don't despair. Focus your mind. There we go. Never in doubt. The time is at hand. Merely say the word. Consider it done. Do your worst. <sighs> I'm prepared for anything. I ride at once. Prepare to be run through. My lance grows ever sharper. We march. To me. Merely say the word. Consider it done. There has to be a way. Understood. Your villainy ends here. One thrust of the lance is all I need. Ooh. K.O. A fine bout.
There we go. I would be honored to accept. Sure, I'll travel to a secluded shore. Stone circle, mermaid carvings, there's a few more up there. Probably gonna be one more doodad. Still need a journal for that stuff. Where's the trigger for this place? Is there one? Or is this just a uh, place where there's enemies? Just want to make sure I didn't miss one. Unless the battle in that town takes all the way over to the west. Which would be insane. Either way, we're going to do this fight. Amy level 14, no problem. This might actually get us somebody. Lord Gislaine, sir. Another village has succumbed. Then you know what must be done. Gather them into the holding pens, the fit and the infirm alike. Is that wise in this downpour, sir? The march of progress ever demands new feet to walk it. There can be no tests without subjects, and those unwilling to sacrifice will never know the sublime beauty of discovery. I assure you, I wouldn't complain were a few pitiful souls to perish in transit either. Sir Baltro. Come to glean more corpses, have you? Take what you will. We've enough rotting flesh to satisfy even your ravenous want for death. Though, not for long, perhaps. This may be the final slew I'm able to offer. And the experiments are proving successful. That's not for you to know. Now, have you come to collect? Or do you simply wish to interrogate us instead? <laughs> Neither. Those who defy Zenoira's rule draw close to your lands. His Majesty would see them tossed like all the rest upon your mountains of carrion. The rebels? Here? No, I've come too far to let my work fall unfinished. You've little need to worry. My men are yours to command in the battle ahead. A welcome gift, and one I'll gladly accept. Tatiana, stay here and ensure the experiments continue as scheduled. Yes, my lord. Guards! Rally the defenses. We depart anon. Gislaine, <sighs> uh, 
Jane has completed the cure, has he? It was only a matter of time, but with all the vital support I've thrown at his back. Your hubris knows no bounds, wretch. One as revolting as you is unfit to stand in the company of Lord Ghislaine. Only by his word have I let your presence go unimpeded. Now go, gather the dead, and be quit of this manner before you drain my patience any further. <laughs> I am no fool. The day will be ours. There's a reason that that is up there. I'll ride any distance. How can I assist? I ride at once. The Cornian militia fights on. Service of the royal family. The time is at hand. Onward. I'll not fail you. As you wish. I'm ready. Heading there now. Order complete. I am yours to command, your highness. You face me. I'll pierce your villainy ends here. Would you ask? Very well. Come then. Try me. In service of the crown. There we go. Level on up. Gaze upon the face. Slay the mage. Shows in my grave yet. I'll not fail you. You face me, I'll pierce you clean through. See, Chloe? There's always more to learn. I shall hold nothing back. What would you ask? Do you need something? Right. We march. The path is set. Gaze upon the face of your demise. For the liberation. I'll not fail you. By your word. Come then. I never... Your villainy ends here. Come then. Victory grows ever closer. The position is ours. We shall make proper use of this. The time is at hand. <laughs> Onward. Who's my target? here to protect those who can't protect themselves awaiting your command the time is at hand the path is set you face me my legs grow heavy we march
I'll not fail you. As you wish. I shall hold nothing back. I've not chosen my grave yet. What would you ask? By your word. The time is at hand. To me. Awaiting your as you wish, as expected. I'll not fail you. By your word. I shall try my best, and yet... I'll brook no interference, rebel curse. I don't have one. I don't have a uh, strength one. I'm here too. go Oh my work to curb death's march only to perish in his modest hand We march Come then In the crew. I can't fail my sacred mission. That's not a main camp. Where is it? I presume you're the ghastly lord responsible for this plague and its death strewn offensive. You would accuse me of diffusing such evil through my own lands? Me, who at last stands on the precipice? of seeing it eradicated once and for all. <laughs> A shame. I'd hoped <laughs> to welcome the occasion myself one day. But I suppose that honor falls to Tatiana now. At long last, my love, I come to join you once more. Another corpse for the pine, huh? What? A fortuitous thing, that. Were his cure made manifest, all my hard work spreading this pestilence would be for naught. <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Saw that coming. Be 
face your demise. Reason rules the day. I rise to any challenge. Very well. Nowhere is too far. Your villainy ends here. Done. Come then. I've grown stronger. We march. The path is set. Now then. Your orders? A brisk flight. At your service. Sir. Well fought. Time is with us, should we only keep our focus. A fine discovery. A fine bout. The time is at hand. Allow me. Was never in doubt. If you want me, then have me. I'll preserve this place and our research with my very life. There you go. To the next. Lord Jislain, how could you take him from me? What have you found? Horrors taking form, my prince. The jail is rife with corpses of the townsfolk in every which corner. Likely victims of the plague. Tell our men to stay well clear of its walls. But of course. Rumors speak of your lord using his own people for dark experiments into the plague that sweeps this land. What say you? That you're a band of benighted fools if you believe such tripe. Come on, Elaine. There's only one way to find out what he was up to. We've got to search the manor. You won't disturb Lord Jeslane's research. Not while I still draw breath. Then perhaps you'd be willing to serve as our guide instead. Tell us everything that's transpired here, Tatiana. Please. This manor is where Lord Jeslane conducted his research. You know... I was expecting some kind of horrible monster under that mask. Turns out you're just a regular girl. It was years ago that this horrific illness first emerged, swept through our populace like the fiercest wildfire. Lord Jeslane's wife was among the victims. He was never quite the same after that. So intense was his contempt for the plague, he made it his sole mission in life to find the cure. Even if it meant enlisting the services of a monstrous necromancer. And thus, Jislane victimized his own people for his experiments, then proffered their vacant bodies before this necromancer. You misjudge him. 
My lord studied every method, every medicine in his quest to rid the world of this plague. Absent a clear answer, he had little choice but to craft hypotheses and pursue them to their natural conclusions. No solution could be discarded without explicit proof of its faults, nor could any be affirmed as truly effective. Such excuses are lost on the dead. Their sacrifices were not in vain. You imply he found a cure? Not completely. The texts he was given were rife with half-truths and outright lies alike. But the seed is there. And it can grow, if you only let me water it. Please, the answer is finally within arm's reach. Mm. A cure would be most welcome indeed, were this disease to befall our army. Though, should it mean allowing such ignominious research to continue unabated? What say you, my prince? have my trust, Tatiana. Take up the duty Ghislaine held so dear and see it through to the very end. <sighs> what about the rumors? Buying into this thing's not gonna reflect on us too good. We meet them head on. As long as the sick are treated with dignity and honor, that tide will turn. In the end, these studies are meant to benefit all who call Fevrith home. If he was even half the man you claim, that was Lord Ghislaine's intention from the very beginning. Am I to face no sentence? Our enemy here is Zenoira, not you. You only mean to shackle me in their stead. The liberation exists to grant freedom, not oppress the downtrodden further. In that case, I'd like to exercise my freedom to join you on that journey. What about your cure? To be candid with you, it's almost finished. Enough so that I needn't stay here myself. My men should be more than capable of handling the rest. As for me, I'll take this opportunity to walk beside the men who robbed this world of Lord Ghislaine's grace. To see what ideals he chooses to fight, and ultimately to die for. And... When that moment inevitably arrives, to be the one to sound the death knell myself. Come on, only an idiot would let you. Very well then. Should have known that was coming. <laughs> be warned, you may be awaiting my death a great many years. That, and you'll be expected to earn your keep in the meantime. Welcome to the liberation, Tatiana. That's a very weird one. <laughs> but I think with that, we should be ready to go back to Draken. if you do or not. If you're certain... It's a bishop. I'm at 77 now, that's good. Where is she? Virginia. I want to see that one. Wow. Let's see just how strong I can get. Then again, she basically turned into her mom. Just leave it to Lex. Wow, 
Alright, good deal. This should lead straight down into Cornea. Straight down into the main heart of it. It's another statue. And I think with that, we've pretty much covered all the area around. And uh, n now all that's left is to go back to Drakenhold and handle the one. I think we, the battle of uh, Kleinfeld. This was this one leading up to this battle was pretty much. We're almost done with Drakenhold. I feel uh, we don't. I don't think we're strong enough yet to really do the Colosseum, which sucks because that's one of the things I want. Here, I'll put your creepy ass back there. Alright. With all that said, that is all the time I have for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.